The explorer leaves on a ship in search of new lands. Find me a new kingdom to build. Go forth, my Viking warship. All right, everybody, Baron here, and welcome back to the bonfire forsaken lands. So we're gonna continue on day 10 on our last kingdom. We're gonna go assess our workers. Honest, strong. See, this guy's strong and this guy's quick footed. The strong ones need to be made guards. So let's actually check our guards. We've got quick footed, wise, and hard working. So our guards aren't even the best guards possible. Iron miner, quick footed. Farmer, honest. All right, so we've got one of these wood gatherers and he is going to become a guard. So we're gonna change you to a guard. Now, Mr. Strong. We shall give you an iron axe. Now, one of our guards we should probably make. Let's go check out all of our workers overall. But yeah, in the last video, I was like, who wants to see more of this? And it was resoundingly positive. Some gems were found in the iron mine. The hobbit, well, dude, well, look at that. Six gems, excellent. Okay, so now we've got to get, I'm gonna get one of these guards. We're gonna get, let's go with quick footed. Why, like wise? Where should we put the wise one? I'm curious. So since he's quick-footed, let's put him on, where's the furthest job away? Probably the iron mine. So now we got, what, two iron miners, two quick-footed. Oh, that's actually very good. So we're gonna give him a cart. We're gonna give him a pickaxe. Now I'm thinking, are these two new guys? Oh, I really hope they are because we're gonna assess their stats. That's one of the things that we missed the first time around. I was just like, oh, these guys are great. I didn't even think like, I didn't really read into it too much. So we've got these two tuna guys, quick-footed and strong. Guess who Mion's gonna be? Mion, my good man, you shall be a god. And we're going to give you an iron axe. So now we got four guards. Now we're gonna go back there. Let's see, what do we need in order to build? We could build a tannery and I would like to build the tannery. So where's the tannery gonna go? I wonder if the tannery, if one of the wise guys should be that. Now this new guy, he's quick-footed. So let's see, exhausted villagers went to bed, crafting, we can now make what? Leather bags, shields, oh yes. We wanna make shields, we need iron and leather to do that. So I'm thinking, what do you think? This guy's quick footed, I guess. I'm gonna find somebody else. All right, how many guards do we have tonight? We've got four. And two of them are well rested. We've got two strong men. We've got hardworking and wise. So after this night, Raru, who is tired, is going to go to be a tanner. Because I feel like it doesn't seem like we can... Maybe he should be saved for the shipyard. So we're going to get this new guy. And you know what, Mr. Quickfooted? You are going to be a tanner. You need skin and you make leather. All right, I think... I think... And we're going to eventually build a shipyard. So is this going to be like Kingdom where we have to build a ship and escape this island? I think so. Oh, we got a giant werewolf? He got hit before we even took much damage because our warriors are strong. I'm going to skin the beast. That'll give us a little more leather and I'm gonna have my guy working in the mines for now. Go ahead and work in the iron mine. And I love their little war calls, man. It's pretty funny. I do love the art style. It is fantastic. I'm curious what this giant stone wall is all about, because that definitely looks like a wall, doesn't it? So we'll have them go. So yeah, by having full-time guards, our people are going to be well-rested when they have to protect us in the nighttime. And I think we should be able to fight wolves and spiders. And that one looked different than the average wolves. I think we're kind of, as we go forward, we fight different bosses. Like, that was day 10. We should have fought a boss. And I think that was a werewolf. We can afford to have one of our wood gatherers. Let's find someone. This man is honest, hardworking. Let's get a hard, oh wait, these guys do not have their, oh I thought they could use, oh maybe it's because we're out of, ah I think we're gonna need some more iron axes. Give everybody axes, except for this hardworking man. A wanderer stands by the bonfire. All right, Mr. Wanderer, what are you? He's strong. I'm strong, Baron. Put me to work. All right, well, I shall make you a god. All right, it looks like we can build our first set of iron armor. Shields require wood, iron, and leather. 
So if I was to guess, this one costs more resources, so it's probably better. Let's do that. The shield allows villagers to go on expeditions as warriors. Oh. Okay. So I can't even give them that. Okay, so I should be making iron armor instead, I think. Expeditions? What is this about? Oh, there it is. Giant werewolf. Attack it! Attack the other one. There's two of them this time. Wow. We did very good. We're gonna, we're gonna skin both those beasts. And get their furs. Skin the other one. Fortunately, that doesn't give me leather. But yeah, I think leather and iron are the two... Yeah! Are the two keyest resources right now because we have... Oh, oh, do we need a coal mine? Lots of iron, yeah. I think we need to move some of our wood gatherers over. Brave, strong, hardworking. Yeah, you are going to be... We're going to change your job to... Let's go with a tanner. Wise, hardworking, and quick-footed. Migu doesn't really need to be in here, but... Still, still... Oh, we can... Let's make lion armor. Iron armor. Lion armor? <laughs> Alright, so now that we've got that, I want to see if I can't give them to my guards. Tired, tired, tired. They're all sleeping tonight. Aha! I can. And we're gonna give you an iron axe. A wanderer stands by the fire. What stats do you have? Well, uh, well fed, honest, and well rested. I'm not sure what honest really does. I'm gonna have you working the tannery for now. Okay, I can build the shipyard or the coal mine. I'm thinking the ship might need coal, or there's something with this coal mine, and I want one. But let's actually build the hut by the river first. That may attract more people. The next person that comes around, if he's not, like, ideally bred to be... Maybe the warriors should be the brave ones. Some gems were found in the iron mine. What do we use gems for? Oh, wow, we can already build the shipyard. I definitely want more armor, though. More workers can live in the village now. Excellent. We built a house over here. This has to be the coal mine, because this is the iron mine. So, let's might, might as well build it and start saving up the iron. Z Zegu's been with us for a long time. You know what, we should give that, hey, we should give him a little bit of seniority. All right, so, while that's happening, I'm good on food, I'm great on wood. I'm gonna get more iron, even though we've got a decent, no, we're actually low on iron since I just built the other house and the iron mine. Oh god, that's ter- is that a spider sound? That's a spider sound. Okay, okay. Prepare your butts! Oh, he's hit somebody. Oh, he jumped. Okay, we've defeated him. We've taken damage. So, this was what? Day 12 and a spider attack. Maybe every six days? Let's skin the beast. We should get something different than just furs. I don't think we should... Oh, we got gems. Good. We do get something different. Look, everybody suffered damage, especially this guy. Probably the one without the iron armor. I really want that. So we've got leather bags, and I'm wondering if those go... I still want to figure out who gets that. Maybe the farmer could do it. No, he carries a cart. I'm thinking the warriors. Uh, the people who go on adventures. You know, if they have leather bags, they can carry new loot and stuff like that. Would be my guess. Come on, guys. We need more workers. Someone's gotta work the iron mines. And once we get that resource, it should allow us to build something new. Oh, wow. We're gonna need 100 coal to get a steelworks. I think steel weaponry is still a ways off. We just need to get more people here, guys. A small family arrives. This is great. This is great. This is great. We've got two people. Hard working and hard working. Guess where you guys get to go? Actually, let's craft you the pickaxes first. Because I'm gonna put you in the mines. Hey, welcome to my village. We all, uh, work for each other. We're all here, like, hard working out here. And I want- oh. Maybe I need a steel pickaxe for these guys. Now that you're here, um, why don't you go work the coal mines? Probably the worst job. I mean, coal mines are notoriously bad jobs. So we've still got the four guards. It's probably time to get a fifth guard at some point. Just to have, like, superior numbers. Or, I'm kind of curious, I want to set people out on adventures. But I don't know how many we're going to need to do that. 
This costs leather and iron. Two resources we're kind of low on. We'd only be able to get one more shield. Ooh. Yeah. Were, were those wolves? Yep, it's just plain old wolves. Fight them! One, two, three. <laughs> now we skin them. And we get their furs. So we get what? Food and furs. Or oh, wait. I'm just skinning them and getting the food. Do I, I don't even get furs from them. You know what? I'm actually going to convert one of my coal miners to an iron miner, and I think I did the wrong thing. I think I made iron axes instead of pickaxes, which is a stupid move. Now, this- yeah, see, that just makes too much sense. Excellent. Okay. Now- <laughs> Oh, man, I can see it now. All right, yeah, so now we're gonna get a lot more. So there's the coal. It looks like we've got eight total resources. Um, I'm thinking we save up for the shipyard, see what it is. Maybe it's a merchant we can buy stuff. Maybe it's a way off the island. I don't know. So we got- is- do we get something new to craft? Ooh, a wanderer stands by the fire. What do we do with you? You are brave. Can I make you a warrior? Yeah, let's see what happens. Alright, Mr. Warrior. Armor, iron armor. Right hand, iron axe. There we go, we can build the, uh, shipyard. We're gonna do it. I- I'm assuming it's over here in the water, and not in the river. Is there something new? I wish it would highlight what it was that's new, if there is something new. I think it's just meaning we can build something, you know, crap. Something became available. Some gems were found in the iron mine! So what do we do with the soldier? I mean, with the, uh, our warrior. Alright, build this shipyard. Woo! Villagers can now leave on ships in search of new lands? What? How do we do that? And I'm still not sure what leather bags are used for. Maybe we have to craft a ship. There we go. Aha! You have to craft a ship. Duh! That's how we go on adventures. We just need four more iron, so I'm actually gonna do that right now over, over the night time. We'll see what monsters come at us, and then we're gonna build ourselves a ship. Which is 200 wood. And we still need the the steel works. So after the ship's done, and we get 200, I can probably cut back on a lot of my wood production. Maybe only have one guy. Total. Oh my god, we're gonna have to have more people uh, farming. Let's see, leather's pretty good. Yeah, we're definitely gonna need one more farmer. Iron is what? At 46? I'm gonna have to convert you over. Hardworking, quick-footed. Hmm. Oh! Well, werewolf-looking things. Not even wolves. Ooh, one of our guys took damage that time. Alright, you're gonna be a farmer. Alright, let's craft a ship. A pilgrim arrives from the islands of Un. He brings stories of the legendary Idris. Talk to the stranger. What's Idris? The pilgrim says he needs food for his journey. Sure. We don't have that. Why don't I wait for it? Yeah, we'll give you food. He narrates the legend of Idris, imprisoning the Titan, and hands over his armor. Oh, and hands over his armor. I was like, why are his hands over his armor? And this one's wise. What do you do with a wise man? Ooh, explorer. Wise man on a ship. Now what can we give you? Nothing. He just goes and explores. So yeah, we'll have a wise man on the ship. That seems to make sense, so... Maybe when he wakes up, he'll he'll take the ship. So we don't leave on the ship like Kingdom. Oh! The explorer leaves on a ship in search of new lands. Find me a new kingdom to build. Go forth, my Viking warship. Bring me back. Tales of glory and pre preferably lots of food and gold and things of that nature. Well, that's kind of cool. We just sent someone out on a voyage. I'm uh, excited to see what they come or you know what they bring back do they bring back gems oh that sounds like werewolves nope regular wolves we got one two three and four gah 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 and yeah 
Skin the beast, skin the beast. We'll get a nice bit of four food added. So when does this boat come back? I, I hope they like, they should play like a, a horn or a signal. Oh, that's giving me skin this time. Is it different? Oh, there we go. Yeah, I guess it's just kind of random. But spiders give gems, because you can't really skin a spider. But you can loot its bowels. Ooh, scouts return with news of a mysterious cave. Uh, explore dungeon. Ooh, what, an alchemist? Okay, what is an alchemist? We need more warriors, because now we can explore these dungeons. This is pretty cool. Okay, so we, we know two things just from this, just from sending a scout out. One is you can explore a dungeon. Dusk to midnight. It has to be done at midnight. We've got one guy. Should we send him? How many guys do you think we should send on this journey? I'm thinking two or three. But it can only happen from dusk to midnight. So it's limited time available, but I'm thinking... Oh, there it goes. It goes away. Oh, that sounded nasty. Oh my god, it's a giant werewolf. Attack it! Ravenous beast. Oh, there's another one. We're skinning it. Instead of my having my guy fight. It doesn't seem like warriors join in. I don't want to lose one. We've lost one before. There we go, there we go. Okay. And, um, this time I split up iron and coal. I should actually probably move one over. I'm gonna move, uh, Sedu. And I don't have to change their, you know, anything like that. So we've got, I think... Where? There we go. We've got one warrior right now. I guess I converted. Where's my boat? I'm really curious what the boat's gonna bring back to us. The sun is rising on a new day. Exhausted villagers are going to bed and still... The ship has not returned to port. Has it been lost at sea, or is it going to find out the tales of that wanderer who did visit from another island? Ooh, an explorer discovered a city and established a trade route? What? Now we've got trade. Buy, ancient text, times one, price 12 gems. Now we have a U- Okay, let's buy the city of Stratol. What happens? What is this? Ancient text. City of Stratol. Ancient text. Build what? Oh, we can build the steelworks. Some gems were found in the iron mine. Well, that is fantastic. Let's build this new thing. And um, the steelworks, wherever it's going to go, probably... Where's our guy going? He's headed over here. It must fit in right next to the coal mine. Let's see him build it. Gosh, we've really upgraded our tech, haven't we, man? I'm so excited. I'm, I'm curious to see what we can craft now. We're entering a new age. And there's... Workers can now produce steel from the iron... From iron and coal. Okay. What can we craft? Steel armor and steel swords. Maybe... It doesn't look like there's any different types of shields. It's just kind of like a... Carts? Oh, I thought that... <laughs> it's a carrot, alright. A wanderer stands by the bonfire. Okay. I hope you're wise. Honest. You know what? You're gonna be a steel worker, my boy. Now, as a steel worker, what do you need? You can carry a cart. Can we craft a new item? Pickaxe, bows and arrows, iron armor, shields, steel swords, steel armors, ships. Oh, man, you know what I think? I don't know if that guy's ever gonna return. No, he's gotta return. I don't know what to do with this. Other than the fact that we have it. None of the scouts returned? What? No! Alright guys, so... Exhausted villagers have gone to bed. I would say... I'm not sure what these uh, ancient texts are for. But we have established a trade route. Maybe if we establish other trade routes, we can buy different types of items and goods. Maybe someone's gonna sell us weapons, someone's gonna sell us- What is that? Oh, that's steel. Fantastic. I'm not sure what else. We can craft steel armor. I wonder if he- what are these leather bags for? I still don't know what they are for. If you guys know what leather bags are for, let me know. Baron's Brigade, do you want to see more? We have made it to day 17. We have built ships. We have researched and found steel armor. Hold on the phone. Hold the phone. 
We can't craft anything new. Maybe once we get a certain amount of text, we can get alchemists. Anyway, I'm sure we are about to be attacked by some nasty beasties of the night. What say you? Do you want more? You wanted more after episode one. Do you want more episode after episode two? Because I feel like with shifts, ships, and these explorers and adventurers, we're just now entering the meat and potatoes of our kingdom. Now, is this one of those games where it's just survive as long as possible? Do you think we could reach day 100? Do we have to move to a new land? I'm not sure how this is going to work. I'm very excited to explore more with you guys. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. I've got to get ready to stream right now.